Digging out in Lowell, it was the jackpot zone that saw two feet of snow. In the meantime, it was an entirely different story along the shore here in Sandwich. Battering surf and coastal erosion took part of a home into the sea. Good evening to you and thank you for joining us. I'm Anna Redis Rodriguez. The storm was all about location. WBC's Christina Rex reports on the cleanup. The city of Lowell takes the cake for this nor'easter with two full feet of snow falling. Now shoveling out from that snow was an all-day experience, but as you can see, some people decided it just wasn't even worth it. From dawn, <laughs> I've been up since seven o'clock at the back of the house till dusk. People in Lowell ran out of places to throw the 24 inches of snow they spent all day shoveling. Yeah, it's pretty tough right now. Um, kind of wish the plow came through. On the south shore, hard to believe it was the same storm. Not a snowflake in sight, but huge waves along the coast. It's pretty amazing. Uh, the, the sound is just breathtaking with the rocks and, and, and the wind. It's, it's pretty jarring. That wind had a massive impact in Sandwich. Taking down three homes along Salt Marsh Road, leaving appliances thrown across the beach. Neighbors say with the beach eroding, it was only a matter of time. When I built this house 17 years ago, there was another probably 60 feet of beach from what there is right now. So it's, it's definitely accelerating and it's, it's scary. It wasn't all damage and frustrating cleanup, though. There you go, there you go. <laughs> For some lucky kids in Lowell, this storm brought a gift. Now, with all this snow in different parts of the state and temperatures dropping, the concern now is ice, so officials are urging you to be careful while driving. In Lowell, Christina Rex, WBZ News.